What's up, YouTube? It's YBC, and I'm back bringing you guys some NBA 2K16 My Team Gauntlet gameplay. And in this gameplay, you guys saw in the title and at the start of the screen, we have Diamond J.R. Smith from when he was on the Nuggets. And I'm bringing Diamond Smith, Diamond J.R. Smith gameplay here. And he's just a beast. And you guys see right here, he just drains a three. And it's a 21 point challenge as well. So we have to basically score all our points with J.R. Smith. Without further ado, let's get it. And J.R. Smith again with the nice three already starting off great. And I don't know how that was in the steal right there. You guys see PG-13 putting in a little bit of work. But he makes a nice mid-range. And you guys saw in the beginning, uh, PG-13 just drained a deep three in my face. That was kind of nasty. And right here, I had to get score all my points with J.R. Smith. And I would have took the layup. But we get a three with Diamond J.R. Smith. And so far, he's just a beast, yo. But he did start off pretty cold. He did miss about four threes in a row, I'd say. And I know you guys probably don't want to see that, and that's why I filtered it out. But yeah, he missed like probably four threes in a row at the start. But oh my goodness, back to back threes again by J.R. Smith. Yo, like, I would say cop this card, but a lot of us don't have that type of MT. But yeah, just cop that card. <laughs> I mean, I know it's uh, almost impossible to cop that card without spending a lot of money on 2K. And right here, is he going to hit it back to back to back? Oh no. So close, right on the line to A plus release, and he comes down and misses the mid range with PG, and he gets the offensive board, and he jumps shots from inside the key, and he makes it. And right here, I'm just trying to shoot another three with Jr. Smith, and without seeing the release, it goes in again. This diamond Jr. Smith is insane. I know I keep saying that, but if I had the MT to get this card, I would get it like. 10 out of 10 times, not even 9 out of 10, 10 out of 10 times I would get this card, because this card is unstoppable, it can dunk, it can shoot, it can do anything, and right here, I get double teamed, and I just pull out for a 3, and I knew I probably would have went in, but it was right on the line, and this is my first time playing with J.R. Smith, and with the diamond, but most importantly J.R. Smith, because I don't know his release, and I'm getting it down a little bit, and I'm getting it right on the line, as you guys see, I missed the A- right there, and this guy just pulls up a mid-range again with PG-13. I think he was trying to do a 21-point challenge of his own with PG-13. And yet again, just J.R. Smith, like, shooting it from Stephen Curry range. And he has, like, unlimited range. And right here, like I said, I think he's doing a 21-point challenge with PG. Oh, never mind. He's not. And for a second there, I thought he was because he's been shooting all of his shots with PG-13. Probably because PG-13, Paul George, is his only playmaker and. Mo buckets and most space gets fouled, and he just shoots a I mean, fadeaway mid range with the hand in his face. Probably wasn't the best shot he could have took, but right here I am open again with J.R. Smith. Don't even know his release, and this gets an A minus, and for some reason that didn't go in. I mean I, that should have went into me. I mean I got his release down, and he misses an open three. Like you guys see right even right there, um, it showed up my release. It was right on the line. Like, it could have easily have given given me a perfect release on that three. But it's all good still. We're up by 4. 14 to 10. And Josh Smith is about to come down. And oh, he gets blocked. Yeah, I thought he was going to post drive Mo Buckets. And right here, I, I really did think he was going for a 21 point challenge. That's why I'm double teaming. And he shoots a 3. And I don't know how that was. And that should have went in. And you know, I'm just going to come down and just shoot it with J.R. Smith. And then goes in. A minus uh, shot quality. And I don't know, line too. Like these releases, like, I. I if you play with J.R. Smith, you never play with him. His release is so easy. And right here, he gets his off own rebound with PG, and he just launches it up here. And luckily, it didn't go in. And J.R. Smith again with the A play. Oh, like that should have went into me. 2K should have gave me that shot. I mean, A plus shot quality. It's almost like a perfect release to me. And right on the line too. Just J.R. Smith, like, I just don't have any more words other than just insane, and I, I don't have any more words for this card. Like, he's pulling up from so deep, and it goes in again. He's pulling up from, like, behind, or, like, right at the 2K Sports logo in the middle of the court. Like, I just, like, let me know what you guys think of this card. Is it insane? Is it cheesy? Is it, what is it to you guys? Like, leave a comment below. And right here, I'm just about to size him up. I'm trying to... Uh, take his ankles off right here 
and I'm sizing him up. I'm trying to just, and I just launch it up right there. I was trying to have a little fun, just cheese and abuse him a little bit right there. La Queso and Espanol, la cheese. La Queso and some cheese. And PG-13 trying to be like J.R. Smith right there. And no, you're not J.R. Smith. You're not a diamond card. It's not going to go in. And right there, I pulled from half court. And oh, so close. If that would have went in, I just, I don't know what I would have done. And <laughs> he's trying to get me back with PG-13. And he does. And J.R. Smith just comes down. And I wanted the game right here. But I got him up in the air. And I wanted to fade away right here just for fun. And no, uh, I'm going to pass it out and I get it stolen. And this video is coming to a close. And this, like I said, I don't have any more words to say. I don't want to keep going on about this card. Like it's You guys already see the type of gameplay and what capability this card has <laughs> and yeah it's pretty much it in another mid-range and this game is pretty much over i'm gonna come down and get that w next possession and yeah thanks again so much for the support the 100 subscriber wager gameplay is i want it to come out tomorrow but we haven't done the wager i'm not gonna tell you who wins because that's basically a spoiler and one of us hasn't done the wager yet and you guys will see what it is. And, yeah, thanks again so much for the support. Can we get 200 subs before Monday or Tuesday? And it's YBC, and I'm out. Peace.